Hi dear students, welcome back to our channel Anvin Kumar Basics of Physics. This is the right place to learn. So children, in this video, I am going to explain about the most most important question for 4 marks in the chapter of motion in plane. That is, show that the trajectory of an object show that the trajectory of an object at certain angle with the horizontal is parabola that is the question children so for this we have four marks most important it is repeated so many times in the examinations public examinations and be useful for both ap and ts also first thing you have to learn, learn what is a projectile projectile is nothing but if any object is projected into the air by making some angle with the horizontal then the body will reaches the ground in the path of parabola then that body is called projectile oka object ni manam horizontal ki konta angle chestu project chesinappudu aa object anedi oka parabolic path lo ground ni reach avutundi appudu dani manam em antam ante projectile antam so simply i am showing here so this is the horizontal means what x axis clear and it is the y axis now this is the point of projection from that point one body is projected like this with velocity u with velocity u at this point of projection the body is projected into the air by making some angle theta clear e direction lo project chesinappudu adi a direction lo move avutundi move ayyata pun tarata konta dooram tarata em avutundante the should be comes like this because of under influence of gravitational force gravitational force clear actually manam e pro e direction lo project chesinam so adi e direction lo vellali kaani em ayindi straight line path lo kaakunda the should be comes like this in the path of parabola ila undedane antam parabolic path antam so mari ila velalasindi ila enduku vachindi ante because of gravitational force clear so the body which can moves in the path of parabola when it is projected into the air with some angle other than 90 degrees 90 degrees angle kaakunda project chesinappudu adi ground ila reach avutundi enduku man other than 90 degrees antam ఒక వేళ నైంటీ డిగ్రీస్ ప్రొద్ద ప్రొవైడ్ చేస్తే అది వర్టికల్లీ ప్రొవైడెడ్ బాడీ అవుతుంది వర్టికల్ ప్రొవైడెడ్ బాడీ అవుతుంది క్లియర్ చేయలేదు సో ఇది సింపుల్ కాన్సెప్ట్ మనకి ప్రొజెక్టల్ చాలా ఎగ్జాంపుల్స్ ఉన్నాయి ఏ బాడీ ఈస్ త్రోన్ ఫ్రమ్ సడన్ హైట్ అండ్ ఏ బుల్లెట్ ఫైర్డ్ ఫ్రమ్ ఏ గన్ అండ్ ఏ బాల్ హిట్ బై ది క్రికెట్ బ్యాట్ సో ఆల్ ఆర్ షుడ్ బి మోస్ట్ లైక్ దిస్ పారాబోలిక్ పాత్ సో దీస్ ఆర్ ద ఎగ్జాంపుల్స్ ఫర్ ప్రొజెక్టైల్ మోషన్ and here one word it is there that is what trajectory trajectory means that the path followed by the projectile projectile a path way to move thundo dani mana em antam ante trajectory antam so this is the common idea about the what is projectile and examples okay children now you have to understand this one very clearly at this point of projection at this point of projection initial velocity is u and when it is moving in the plane of x y in the plane of x y the velocity is divided into two components velocity is divided into two components so that's why here we are sim simply showing that according to the resolution of vectors according to the resolution of vectors this is the initial velocity u and this is the vertical component u y and this is the horizontal component like this so this is u y and this is u x clear so now it is what this is the angle why because we can consider the same like this so now these two are equal and these two are equal so then the diagonal should be like this clear in this case we have to derive the expression for now horizontal component and vertical component children horizontal component to what is u x what is u x so here horizontal component the velocity is divided into two components one is what horizontal component that is u x is equals to u cos theta that is the first thing 
एंड सिमिलरली वर्टिकल कॉम्पोनेंट वर्टिकल कॉम्पोनेंट दैट इज यू वाई इज इक्व टू यू साइन थीटा सो यू हैव टू रिमेम्बर दीज टू फर्स्ट इनिशियली क्लियर हाउ वी आर गेटिंग लाइक दिस मीन्स लाइक दिस सो हियर वॉट इज दिस इज द एंगल फ्रॉम दट वॉट राइट साइन थीटा इज इक्व वॉट राइट एस ऑपोजिट साइड बाय हाइपोटनस वॉट इज ऑपोजिट साइड हियर दिस इज यू वाई एंड दिस इज यू सो दिन वॉट राइट साइन दी डाई इज इक्व टू यू वाई बाय यू फ्रॉम दट वॉट राइट यू साइन दी डाई इज इक्व टू यू वाई सो लाइक दैट वी गेट यू वाई इज इक्व टू यू साइन दीटा इन द सेम मैनर नाउ वी हैव टू राइट कास्ट थीटा कास्ट थीटा वर्ड इज एस एडिशन साइड बाय हाइपोटनस एडिशन साइड वर्ड इज यू एक्स दैट इज वॉट यू एक्स बाय यू देन वॉट राइट cos theta is equals to u x by u and u x is equals to u cos theta so in this way we are getting the horizontal component and vertical component children now we want to find out the displacement along the x axis and y axis let's go for that children now we have to find out the displacement along the x axis so now we can go for displacement we want to find out the displacement along the x axis that is children for that we have to take the equation s is equals to ut plus half at square we have to take clear in this case so we are taking the displacement along the x axis that's why simply we have to write a is equals to g and that should be zero Why the acceleration is zero? Let us discuss. And now s is equals to x, and u is equals to u x. We want to find out the displacement along the x axis. Kavati, u is equals to u x under now. What is u x? Horizontal component. And s is equals to x. Here, why the acceleration is zero? Why the acceleration is zero? When the body is moving at the same height, at everywhere same height. then the acceleration due to gravity or the gravitational force is everywhere is same clear when the body is moving at the same height on that body the gravitational force is same at every point it means that force is same when the force is same velocity is same what we know f is equals to m a f is equals to m a we are taken so and what is a change in velocity change in velocity by time so epudaithe f is equal to ma force anedi f that is what again f is equal to mg rasam okay leave it gravitational force anedi manaki same unnapudu adi oke velocity move avutundi oke velocity move avutundante change in velocity em avutundi zero avutundi kabatti when there is same amount of gravitational force acting on the moving body along the x axis then the acceleration is zero because there is no change in its velocity that's why simply what you have written children a is equals to zero from that what right what is s x x is equals to u x into t plus half into a value is zero into t square then what do you get s is equals to u x into t plus zero then x is equals to what u x into t clear and from that what right x is equals to what is the value of u x u cos theta into t x is equals to u cos theta into t from that what right this is a displacement along the x axis from that what right t is equals to x by u cos theta this is the equation number 1 children now we want to find out the same way we have to find out the displacement along the y axis let's go for that now we have to find out the displacement along the y axis by using the same equation so that is what displacement along the y axis in this case again we have to go for equation s is equals to u d plus of a t square in this case we can write s is equals to y along the x axis na budu mana s is equals to x iskunam kabatti s is equals to y and u is equals to u y indu nenu iskunam x axis na budu u is equals to x iskunam kabatti ikkada u is equals to u y and a is equals to minus z it is not zero here and t is equals to t as usual t is equals to t then substitute those values there then what we get 
एस इज मीन वाट वाई वाई इज ईक्वल टू यू वै इंटू टी प्लस हाफ इंटू ए वाल्यूज वाट मैनस जी इंटू टी स्क्वे देन वाट गेट चिल्ड्रेन वै इज ईक्वल टू यू वै वाल्यू मीन वाट यू सैन थीटा सो यू सैन थीटा इंटू एंड टी वाल्यू इज वाट चिल्ड्रेन एक्स बै यू का थीटा एक्स बै यू का थीटा प्लस आफ माइनस 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 हाफ इंटू g into again t value x by u cos theta all square then what we get we will get here like this then y is equals to u sin theta u u cancel then what we get here simply look here u cancel then what we get sin theta by cos theta into x minus Half into g into we have to apply the square. Then what do you get? X square by u square cos square theta. So here sine theta by cos theta means what? Tan theta. Y is equals to tan theta into x minus half into or g by we are writing like this two u square cos square theta into x square. Clear. सो जी बै टू इंटू यू स्क्वे का दिन सपरेट रहा नव वी हाव टू टेक् वैस ईक्वल टू दिश टैन थीटा वी हाव टेक् दिस्ज द ए वाट इज टैन थीटा इज ईक्वल टू ए एंड दिस टर्म ईक्वल टू बी देन वाट रईट वैस ईक्वल टू ए इंटू एक्स मैनस बी इंटू एक्स स्क्वे वैस ईक्वल टू एक्स मैनस बी एक्स स्क्वे That means we are adding a x plus of minus b x square. This is the equation, children. This equation represents the a parabola equation, parabolic equation, parabolic equation. So, children, y is equals to a x plus of minus b x square. And the okay, parabolic equation is to be shown. And why and and the displacement travelled by the projectile. And the model on the okay, parabolic equation of model on the kabati. so so what you have to say the path followed by the projectile is parabola therefore the trajectory of a projectile is parabola so this is the way to prove children chaala simple mana complete exam lo chaala depth kalta gaani ip ki saripothundi em led simple man displacement ela undi x axis ga nukovali ela undi y axis ga nukovali okay na so ee ee concept meek ardham aithe वीडियो ने लाइक चयें षेर चयें कामें एवरते इंटरमीड एग्जाम प्रिपेर अवतारो वाल की मन ान सजेस्टी मन की अभी इंपारटेंट क्वेश्चन प्ले लिस्ट उ दयचे आ प्ले लिस्ट चूसको ओके थैंक यू